Levy Cup, field in line. 1700 meters, eight and a half furlongs. They're off for the Ian Levy Cup. Fair start, Jean de Pilot jetted off, gets an early lead and opens up a distance over Sparkle Diamond now beginning to make gains. Santorini races on the outside of King Arthur, further and beyond, kept off those fractions. Toward the outside, that's Calculus and Roy Rogers racing as a team. Crimson races up next. Toward the back, that's Hovercraft and Supreme Soul trails. Down the back stretch they go in the end leaving. They've left the six and make their way toward the five and Sparkle Diamond sets the fractions. Hounded all the while by King Arthur, a break of five to Santorini. Further and beyond are beginning to pick up a bit. Rojon the pilot on the outside. Crimson races next. Calculus tucked in between horses. The Grey Roy Rogers is kept off the fractions early as the leaders go to the half mile. Hovercraft toward the back and Supreme Soul going nowhere at the moment. They've left the half mile, they arrive at the 716 Spark Diamond. One speed, asked to go all the way, leads up by five lengths. King Arthur is chasing as they go slipping past the three. Here is further and beyond, now beginning to launch his attack. Calculus not too far away to land a blow. Rajon the pilot and Santorini team up ahead of Crimson, but they're into the lane. And it is Sparkle Diamond stepping just off the fence and further and beyond now shoots through like a rocket and picks up the lead. It is further and beyond now beginning to open up. King Arthur left over against the fence, right against it stands Crimson. Calculus now wound up for his late run, but it is further and beyond with a clear lead inside the final 16th. It is further and beyond coming away under Robert Halliday. Further and beyond may have sealed the championship for Anthony Newlis, but we'll have to wait and see. Calculus is second, and then Crimson, King Arthur, Santo.